Now it's time not only to believe that we can stay in the Premier League, now it's time to fight for it. And uh, not only the players, uh, the stands, the whole town has to fight for it. So you must be very satisfied with that. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> like you can imagine and I think if you know that the players played 120 minutes on Tuesday and on what a fantastic run Bournemouth was uh, till they arrived here, this makes this performance, which was a very good one, uh, even bigger from my point of view. This was defensively very organized, very aggressive very focused we won the ball high up the pitch in dangerous areas we created uh, dangerous situations we scored four wonderful goals and you have seen when Bournemouth scored the equalizer if you give them space they are a threat in the offensive and we minimized this today over the whole game because all the players work together defensively and in the offense I think we've seen some individual fantastic performances today from some of our players and collectively we attacked very good as well. Can I ask you about uh, Alex Pritchard, he's a player that maybe Huddersfield fans haven't seen a, a lot of so far, given his first home start today and have really made most of it. Yeah, he was, he was a handful today. He was. Uh, he scored, he got an assist with this penalty, he always wanted to have the ball even in the tight spaces, he was creative, his link-up play was very well, uh, he, he, he played fantastic and uh, he worked defensively, uh, very intelligent and very good as well, so uh, he, he is he's a talent, this is why we signed him and he has shown it today, unfortunately he is cup tie and uh, against the uh, big guns we sometimes uh, choose a formation without this uh, the number 10 and this was the reason why he wasn't so much involved in the first weeks but uh, he will help us and he has shown today what a great player he is and uh, that we are very happy to have him in our squad. Steve Mooney showing his ability as an all-round striker too while taking a hold his head and Yeah absolutely I think uh, both Today were a threat. Uh, Steve, a great header, a great one-touch finish. His link-up play was very good and he worked together uh, as a first defender with uh, Pritchard in the defense as well. So it was a outstanding performance of uh, Steve Muni. He didn't uh, score his hat-trick because Van Lepara had an uh, idea, a good one to be honest. And managers are always satisfied if have if players have own ideas and uh, successful own ideas. And I'm happy for Rajiv that he scored this penalty, uh, even if I think Steve probably expect a assist in the near future because he has <laughs> stolen his hat trick. Was, was, was Steve okay with that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. As I said, uh, if he gets assist in the near future, he will be happy with it. Uh, how's Aaron Moore? Um, we have to wait, so he has a cut uh, over his knee, uh, got some stitches, we have to see and wait how serious it is, uh, how quick he can recover, so uh, this is the injury he has. No, 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 it's, uh, it's only a cut, but a deeper one where he needed some stitches, as I said, and then we have to see how quick he can recover from this. Mentioned that the crowd played, played a big part in, in, in the performance today, suggested that his team were a little bit intimidated to the, to the crowd. How important were they to you in terms of building up your, your performance? Yeah, we said this in the pre preparation for this game. Now it's time not only to believe that we can stay in the Premier League, now it's time to fight for it. And uh, not only the players, uh, the stands, the whole town has to fight for it if we all together like to survive and we all together like to survive and this is what everybody has to show and I think uh, the supporters has shown it today uh, we had f five to ten minutes which were difficult Bournemouth were, were good at the beginning but afterwards I think uh, we played well and the support over the whole uh, time was outstanding like the support was very very good over the whole season but uh, this should never drop and this is so important that it doesn't depend on where you are on the table. It only depends on we like to stay in the Premier League and this is what we wanted to make clear to the supporters. 
the support and that they back us cannot depend on where we are on the table. This can only depend on that everybody likes to fight for the Premier League and the players, uh, the supporters have shown it and I'm very, very proud and very delighted for them that the players were able to pay back with a great performance. Do you know how big a win is this psychology, the fact that you've lost your previous fine and then you win and you win in the standard? Yeah, of course, it was a huge win for all of us. We said this before the game that this is a, a, a massive game for us. But... In the dressing room, all Trafford, we said, okay, boys, now we have the difficult fixtures behind us. Now it's time to start to build up momentum against the opponents which are in front of us, maybe opponents where we are more competitive. It's one thing to speak about it, and then it's the other thing, and this shows character, to do it. And uh, the players have done the first step on Tuesday when they came from behind and won 4-1 and today they've done another step that they are really will try to build up positive momentum what we need and uh, now we have it and we like to keep it as long as we can and with this support and with this energy which we have in the stadium and in the town i'm i'm very confident and i have the belief like i said this the whole season that we have a chance to survive and we will work as hard as we can as hard as we've done today to take this chance of course it helps us chinese we have the dog <laughs> as well yeah the so terriers. for the terriers uh, no better year than the year of the dog <laughs>